Christmas story. You're so bundled up. You can't even move. I'm like oh, Ralphie, okay. little brother. I'm like Ralphie, little brother. We always train on Sundays. <laughs> Sunday fun day, man. Whoa. My Velcro is blown out. Yeah, these are funky. These smell like a championship training camp. <laughs> it's, it's bad luck to wash your, your hand wraps during training camp. Uh -huh. Did you know that? It's science. Double job. Little flow. But the next time, I will defeat you. I'm the most durable dude around, man. I take punishment from these guys all day, every day. That's I punched them in the face last week. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what came over me. I just said, fuck the pad. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not doing anything fancy. That's fine. Like, Neither am I. Get some basic we, we, yeah. we, we already worked our combos. Okay, we're, we're on point. Whatever combo you want, linear, circular. Go, Carlos. Go movement after those combos. This is a light one. We didn't even go that hard today. It's just getting in, moving around, sweating. No, it was great. Felt good. Moved around a little bit. I get depressed when I just sit around the house anyway, so I, I'm moving. Feeling good, ready to take title. It's kind of like a family time. He's into fishing. He thinks he's the best fisherman in the family. She likes fishing, but she doesn't like taking him off the hooks. Ready? Yep. Oh, there's a few more. There's three more. Need some help, Glenn? Nah, I've got it. He doesn't play anything for fun. Nothing. Even like Uno, it's like a big deal. It's just for fun unless you're keeping score. And I'm keeping score. Buddy, I don't know what it is. Oh! It's a bass. Oh! Who's taking it off? Yay! There, I'll toss him back. Say goodbye. Give him a kiss. Kiss him! Wow! I didn't even kiss him! I got something. Yay! Is he the bass, Daddy? Yep. Oh! Biggest thing yet! Biggest one today, though. Biggest one today, Glenn. How are you doing? Alright. Yeah. Wait, I'm already big. Yep. Let's get it. Hi! Oh, jeez. Look at that monster bass. Oh, and I got it. Yeah, you did. That's a, that's a big one. A monster. A monster, okay. Holy cow, buddy. Did you catch that? Yeah. Good job. If the fishing stuff, put. If the shiners, they're back in the box. Put you in charge. Have to get all my stuff packed, make sure I have all my gear for drilling techniques. I just look as I'm going to fight. It's another day for me. I'll probably wear like a quarter of the stuff that I pack, pretty much the same as when I started. Maybe the stuff I packs a little bit nicer than it was. It's a little colder in Vegas right now too, so I have to make sure I pack a little warmer. Cool. to Vegas. Okay. Very excited and I'm, I'm ready to fight tonight. But obviously I have to wait till Saturday. Andre! It'll be a very tough fight for Andre. Uh, you know, Stipe has a great chin. He stays right in there. Uh, he's got great endurance. So uh, Andre's really going to have to push hard to win this fight. Andre is going through a career resurgence, obviously. He's right up there in the mix at the top of the heavyweight in the world. So yeah, it's been a long road, but I'm really glad that uh, he's doing so well. The clue. Andre, when you first meet him, he's a little standoffish, but he's actually uh, has a really good heart. 
a prankster. He always likes playing practical jokes on people. Um, once you realize that he's teasing you most of the time when he's being mean, then most of the guys warm up to that. And, uh, yeah, everybody loves him. He's, he's one of the popular guys here. Hey, go, let go! And he wasn't here. Dude, let go! That's why I like this tough midget. I said I like you, hey. I said I like you in the camera. I love Andre. He's a cool guy. I'm an angry giant. <laughs> <laughs> I like you way better than Maximus. Even though you love Maximus more than you love me. See? Uh, I like this midget. Well, that's the only reason he likes me because he actually came with body shots, and I'll, and I'll take it. <laughs> Working out is awesome, dude. I love it. You know what I mean, it's like the comfort zone, dude. You know, you guys are awesome. It's like a big uh, you know, playground. You know, we got a good brotherhood, and it's just fun. You know, I love being here. We're also state champion wrestler. <laughs> what? It's the only one on the carpet. That's right. Oh. Can't knock him. He wrestled in college too. You know, he's uh, he's solid. You know, in all aspects of his game. Uh, I definitely think if him and I had to go takedowns, you know, we could make it interesting. I don't have that big block jaw that he has to stay in the the stand up fighting game. But takedowns. Hey, is that Jamie's water? Hey, give me some oil. Of course, fight is first, you know what I mean? That's what I do. It's what pays my bills, you know, and uh, fight playing, you know, I do it part-time. I've been doing it for six, seven years now, and I love every day I go to work there. There it is. That looks a lot better. Mm, it's got a little color to it. What do you call it color? There. That's better. <laughs> I'm all greasy now. I can't believe it worked. That's the best part. <laughs> that was ballsy. You think so? I think we're going. Saving people, helping people. It's just something I always wanted to do, and I would never stop being a firefighter just because I love what I do. You know, I love just helping people. Kayla, you're driving. <laughs>